Sister Elihe, Salesian sister. Well, I've told you about a very holy sister and a very holy priest. And today I want to tell you about a very holy young man. He was born um, in London, just across the river from us, uh, born of Italian parents, living in London, over in Chelsea, in uh, Chelsea, sorry. And um, he, he was born in uh, 1991. He was a remarkable, a remarkable boy. They moved from London back to their original Italian home, went to back to Milan. So he was, he's an Italian boy really, though born in London. And his parents were, you know, they weren't particularly good practicing Catholics. They were, they, but he, from his first communion, he had a, a remarkable love for the Mass, for the presence of Jesus in the Blessed Sacrament. And he was just a remarkable boy. And he was full of, full of charity. He was kind to everybody. And um, he had a great gift for today, what youngsters are interested in today. He had a great gift with all things to do with computers, with the media, and he used that. He used it, he felt that it was a wonderful way of spreading the word of God. And he used it for that. He, he set up websites and he helped his parish, he helped his school in every, every way that they could use technology. And he, he had a, a, a clever saying really, he said, we're all born originals, but so many of us die as photocopies. So he had, he had a wisdom that was really beyond his years. Um, he died uh, very young, just about 15, uh, 2005. And on the 10th of October, uh, he was declared blessed. So we're hoping that next year, the Holy Year, 2025, he will be canonized because miracles have been, well, they're attributed to him, this young boy, so full of love for Jesus, so full of love for the Mass, and a wonderful understanding. I mean, he loved football. He loved all the things that, that young lads enjoy. And he had a great gift for friendship. And he was good to everybody. He, he, he helped the, the poor. He helped the disabled. He helped old people. He helped in his parish. He helped everybody with a great love and a great joy. His name, Carlo. Carlo Acutis, and he is, uh, his body is there visible in the, ch the church of St. Mary Major in Assisi in Italy. And his mother is, she's very often uh, called on to speak about her dear son. So there we have a modern, a millennial saint, Carlo Acutis, a young boy full of the love of Jesus.